Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Punk Rock Review, home of a bunch of opinionated crap you don't care about, also the home of the feedback you provide that we don't care about, keeps us on an even playing field, and we like that. Real quick shout out to our sponsor, this one comes in from Stephanie. Hey, my boyfriend showed me this channel, I think it's pretty funny, haha, ha. here's three dollars, I wanted to see if you actually say what we say, abracadabra, I am very stupid, ha ha ha, just kidding, keep up the good work. Well, bless, you could have had way more fun with us than that, but three dollars spent is three dollars well spent, now you will be immortalized and crappy video -ness. Anyhow, moving straight into it today. Today we're going to be talking about a group, man, that has been around for, uh, you know, a good couple few decades, man. We've checked these guys out live. Uh, you know, yeah, gone through, uh, you know, ample, ample listens of their catalog in the past and everything. But hey, they're back just like ALF in pog form with a vengeance. And we are, of course, talking about 311, the, uh, you know, songs in question or album in question, whatever you want to call it, because it's really just kind of a little singles release. But uh, the Don't You Worry, uh, good feeling uh, release, man. All in all, what can be said about it, man? Well, it starts immediately worrisome with how slow it is as far as what you would be, you know, in our opinion, looking for from some new 311 material coming out. Now, don't get me wrong, uh, you know, the groovy, slow tunes and stuff like that, they're definitely renowned for and everything. But in a newer release that we hear from a group or band, man, especially of, uh, you know, 311's, uh, you know, history and caliber and what they can bring to the table, uh, really wanted a little more kind of, uh, you know, umph and, uh, you know, kind of more of their, uh, you know, grit put into it and things of that nature. Uh, now, don't get me wrong, that does turn around and finally kind of get there, thankfully, as it kicks it up after a minute or so, man, uh, you know, into the uh, listen and such. Uh, so that's great, man, kind of takes it back to the old schooly kind of, uh, you know, punch that they can put into their songs and things of that nature. If that makes sense, it probably doesn't. Who knows? No one cares. Uh, but yeah, man, it's always uh, great to have new tunes from groups that have, uh, you know, just been around and are iconic in the, uh, you know, industry and things of that nature so definitely worth a check out for any fan and or anyone that's interested uh, of course if you don't like 311 then you probably won't like this because it's well 311 uh don't know how often we will intentionally revisit this one man but uh you know if it pops up on the uh random playlist and such definitely wouldn't skip it over so all in all 311 don't you worry good feeling what can be said about you well you get the uh little T for traditional type 311 because that's what you're going to get from it uh, and that's not a bad thing. So there you go. Does it make sense? No. Doesn't have to. Give us money. Have a good one you probably didn't. We'll catch you next time. Probably won't.